back here in New York. I'm James Brown. The Vikings and Eagles were tied for the best record in football, but today Minnesota has been totally dominated on both sides of the ball. We're going to take you to a more competitive matchup between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Pittsburgh Steelers. The Bengals are up by four. Let's join the announcers at that one. Greg Gumbel, Adam Archuleta, and A.J. Ross. Uh, they, excuse me, the Steelers are winning the takeaway battle, the turnover battle. You know, Joe Burrow has thrown two interceptions. His first one was off a tip ball that was intercepted by the Steelers. His second one, just an incredible play of the year type play by T.J. Watt at the line of scrimmage. But even though that they, they're down minus two in the takeaway department, they still find themselves with a one-point lead. We welcome those of you just joining us here at Akershire Stadium in Pittsburgh. Greg Gumbel, Adam Archuleta, and A.J. Ross. 4.28 to play in the third quarter. Cincinnati's lead is 24-23, and Joe Burrow has been picked twice today. That's six on the season against Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh intercepted him four times week one, twice more today. He's thrown two interceptions against the rest of the NFL. Travion Williams from the goal line. 20, 25, up the sideline with running room and tripped up at the 40-yard line, forward to about the 42. This is a little bit of what's happened today. It's been, a, it's been an interesting game, to say the least, Arch. Well, it sure has. It started off with P. Ryan taking the screen, 29 yards, and then Najee Harris. He's able to take it for a touchdown. P. Ryan, one more time, check down out of the backfield for their second touchdown, and then Pickett responds. Beautiful pass on the corner route. And there's the pick by T.J. 